Welcome back to another edition of the Horseman Don Show. It's Tuesday. I'm out here at the track as I always am, this time getting ready for week number three. Post times is Wednesday through Saturday at 5.25 p.m. here at Delta Downs. I came out before sunrise and we got the story from the jockeys, trainers, grooms, everybody here at the track, so let's check it out. Yes, yes, I'm rolling this morning. Are you? Yes, I am. Got any business this week? Yeah, we run one the last uh, Saturday. Small Five. Yeah. Don't forget about Small it. Small Five. That's the name of the horse? Yes, sir. All right, we'll keep an eye on it. Have a good break. Is you okay? What's going on today, Pine? Oh, I'm doing good, Pop. Man, you got your hands full. Oh, yes, sir. I just started with Miss Alley right there. We got five right there. Working hard. Yes. Glad to oh, be back yeah. at Delta. Yes, sir. I love this year. Oh, well, good. <laughs> All right, well, don't work too hard, okay? okay. All right. How you doing, Karen? Yeah, good. How you doing, Philemon? Pretty good, sir. How yourself? Good. Yeah. Are you working with your new agent, Tony? Mm hmm Yeah, still working this you week. Good? You're working hard, aren't you? Yeah. Got a lot of mounts this week? No, not too many. Maybe six, seven. All right. You just yeah. kind of like, you just chug right along every week, don't you? Yeah. You're just a mainstay, a regular here. Yeah. You work hard, man. I like that. Okay, thank good you, luck sir. this week. All yeah, right, thank thanks. You, sir. What's up, Jeff? Yeah, I think the tractor scared him off. What do you oh, think? Oh, that's right, the tractor was coming. Yeah, Pee Wee apologized. He said he didn't know my drone was out there. I had to take my chance. I wanted to get close to him. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Maybe I'll do it another time. You saw you saw the video? Yeah. Cool. Paulina and Daryl, going to be a hot team here at Delta Downs? Yeah. I hope so. We're going to yeah. try. <laughs> All right. Now, Daryl, you are going to be, you used to be the stalling superintendent, right? Yes. And now you're going to be her agent? Yes, sir. All right, Paulina, how did you meet Daryl? i um, known him for quite a while, actually. He was my uncle's agent, J.R. Ramirez, so now it'll be passed down. So you got quarter horse connections, oh, huh? Oh, yeah, definitely. Yeah. So, Daryl, I think you can book rides for thoroughbreds? Oh, yeah, for sure. <laughs> I've done a little bit of that, too. Yeah, so when do you get your license, Paulina? Tomorrow. Well, tomorrow, the well. big day. Yes, tomorrow's You're final excited? day. You excited? Very. Very. So when are you going to start riding, you think? Hopefully as soon Hopefully as possible. the following week. <laughs> following week, you're going to enter horses this week, huh? Uh, yeah. That's the plan. How do you think you're going to work together? I think we're going to work good together. Really? That's fantastic. She's got good work ethics and everything. So. Yeah. Now, if people don't know, Paulina, tell us who your father and your family is. Randy Edison is my father, and my family are the Ramirez. J.R. Ramirez, Al Ramirez. All Ramirez, all the Ramirez in the clan. Yeah. That's, that's who we are. And your dad, Randy, rides quarter horses here, right? He does quarter horses and thoroughbreds, actually. He rides thoroughbreds, yeah, too? Yeah, a few of them. Yes, okay. Sir. Now, you're going to ride thoroughbreds. What made the decision to ride that breed rather than the quarter horses? Honestly, <clears throat> truly, um, my weight. My weight is a big difference here. What do you weigh? Can I ask? 105. I'm not supposed to ask a woman her weight, <laughs> but with a jockey, it's a little different. So we're going to add some lead weight to your saddle, uh, right? Few, yes, sir, a little bit. Yeah.
Jonathan, tell me how the first two weeks have gone. Great. We had a real good, it was real good. You had to uh, chase a few down last week. Yes, we sure did. It was tough though. One of the horses gave us a little challenge, but all in all, we did real good. Yeah. How's, uh, how's everybody out on the track been? Good spirits? And yes, very good spirit. I love being around over here. Glad to be back? Yes, yes. Be glad being, doing what I love doing. Now you got the day off. What are you doing at the racetrack? Still observing. <laughs> I, I, I love being out here with the racetrack, the racetrack people. Just can't get away, can you? Can't stay away. Take up fishing or golfing or something. Come on. Um, Mr. <laughs> I got horse, horse in my blood, so I can't go. do nothing else. How's Podius doing? Great. He's a real good horse. Big gray pony horse. Yes, sir. And he can run. He's, he can't do that. <laughs> he needs to do that with your job, doesn't <laughs> yes, he? Yes, he sure need. All right, I'll let you go. Have a good day off. Uh, thank you, sir. All right. Tell me how Ashley's doing. Ashley's doing fine. She had the surgery on the collarbone. They put some plates and screws in there. She's doing well. How's her ribs? Ribs ain't bad, and she's got a little pain in the back. She's yeah. Somebody told me a story the other day. She got home to the hospital, and the next day she's up and around. And she's supposed to be laying down resting. She doesn't want to quit, does she? Oh no, she's all over the place. <laughs> she's all over the place. She's a busybody, huh? Yeah, she is. So when's the prognosis? When will she come back? You know? Uh, she goes to the doctor back next week, and then we'll see how far it's gonna be. And did they have a guess? Like uh, four, six weeks? Maybe something? six to eight weeks, something like that. That's not too bad for as bad as the spill was. No, huh? no. So the race the other night, G's turn, I want to talk about him. I picked him, he came through for me, you did a great job with him. What'd you think of the race? That was a tough spot. I thought it was he was going to have to run for it to, to get the job done, but I like the, his post position and I know he can handle those turns even though he's kind of a big horse, no problem. And. Um, he did exactly like I thought he would. Yeah, tell me about his last two races. He just missed in the prelude, and then he went into grade three super derby. Of course, he didn't fare so well there. And then how'd he come out of that? He come out of both of those races good, but it, it has helped him that he's had this little break in between here. It freshened him up. Yeah. But um, like he, the prelude, he was stuck in traffic the whole way and couldn't get out. And when uh, he finally did, you know, he just misses by a nose and then well, the Super Derby, we got beaten by all the ship-in people. Yeah, Lone so, Sailor, he went on to win the Oklahoma Derby. Right, yeah. right. So, I mean, we didn't get beat by, you know. Slouches. Slouches. Sure. No, that was, exactly. a, that was a tough spot. Yeah. yeah. School up, Donald? Yes, sir. Yeah, I think. Tomorrow night. Who's this? Alluring actor. Alluring actor? Yes, sir. All right. Got a good shot? First time starter. He's been doing super. I think he's he's ready to go. What race is it? Uh, the last race tomorrow night. Last race of the night? Yes, sir. All right. Well, hopefully, you get to the winner's circle. Hopefully. Good hopefully. luck this season. Thank you, sir. All right. Thanks.